Hey guys, fun fact, this is the second time I'm recording this video because I forgot to turn my mic on the first time. Welcome back to the Aminoverse, my name is Mino, and today we're going to be talking about dumb things that I've probably said before. So I wanted to visit a subreddit called Bone Apple Tea. It's one of my favorite subreddits, it's because I feel like I'm not alone in saying the incorrect thing. Also, leave a comment of things that you've said incorrectly before like uncorrectly, for example. I'm gonna leave that in the video. <laughs> All right, the first one I see, foolproof alarm clock. That's a new product idea. <laughs> alarm clock that sounds like my dog throwing up at the end of the bed. I'm gonna be the first to admit, I don't think I've ever really thought about foolproof in that way, like how it's actually spelled. Like I've said it before for sure. I am not an English major either, but I think right and correct are cinnamons. Cinnamons, guys. The cinnamon. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, this is actually pretty cute. I give him a pass. If I was an English professor, I would still give this man an A. I'm assuming it's a man, it could be a woman, who knows. <laughs> Does Wendy still do the 444? This man is asking the important questions and I need to know too. Does Wendy still do the 444? I don't know why I'm assuming all of these people are guys. I really like the response to this. My dude, would you like to buy a vowel? <laughs> this is why I don't post things on Twitter or on really social media anymore because I'm afraid of getting blasted. My mom is an angle. Uh, this is really cute because it was rooted in sentimentality. I like the response here too. It says my dad is a protractor. That's pretty cute. I, I would keep it, you know what? And I would just try to figure out a way to explain why I think my mom is an angle versus getting it corrected or anything. I hate grapes. They disgust me. <laughs> what they be saying though? This is the thing I hate about food. When you buy food and they talk about you behind their back, so I know never to get grapes again. Also, honestly, who hates grapes? That's kind of a strange thing. Grapes are so delicious. They're one of the most refreshing fruits I think exists in the world. I just deleted a very good friend for posting, jobs should hire you whether you have a felony or mis- Oh, I, okay, I get what he's trying to say. All right, I'm gonna read that again now that I know, okay. Jobs should hire you whether you have a felony or misdemeanor. That can't be true. Nobody, nobody actually posted this. This guy is trolling people. He didn't actually have a friend. There's no way that, right? Right, nobody posted this, right? Guys, guys. Touche, he says. <laughs> Touche. Did you mean touchy? I was thinking of getting a cow zone or something. You know, here's the thing. I'm not afraid to admit this. I never knew that calzone had an L in it. Not until I think I saw it at Pizza Hut. So I resonate with dad here. Hi, bone jaw. <laughs> what? Bone jaw, are you dumb? <laughs> it's French for hello. <laughs> I, th I know he was trying to say bonjour. This is actually pretty funny. And now I'm actually gonna adopt that into my language as well. Hey, bonja, welcome in. Another peaceful day, friends are out. You know, this actually makes me really happy. Aside from the grammatical error, this, this is, looks really peaceful. This person, whoever it is, is very clearly living the life. All right, cannibal ate six Jehovah Whiteness, 23 pizza delivery men, two postmen in seven years. I don't even care about the grammatical error here. Who is eating this many people? How? Man, that is so many people to eat. And poor Jehovah's Witness, they're the people that are coming. Like, they're literally delivering food to this person. They're knocking on his door like, hey, have you heard the power of, oh my god. I, so these are all people that are literally coming to this person's house. Why did nobody suspect anything after, like, the first delivery guy? Like, what if he's always ordering from Pizza Hut? And like the delivery driver just doesn't come back. Like who is really not paying attention? All right, this is gonna be the last one, but I really like this one, directly tied to the previous one. No diving or cannibals. All right, so there's no lifeguard on duty. You have to swim at your own risk. So if you're a cannibal, please do not swim and do not dive. We know how closely interlinked those two are together. So don't do either of those things. Or if you do it, do it at your own risk. All right, guys, thanks for hanging out with me for another video. 
The reason why I actually wanted to post this video wasn't because of the content itself. It had a lot to do is because at the very end of this video, I actually have an outro now. What? I wish I had confetti for that moment. Mm, whatever. Anyways, I hope you enjoy these videos. Don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you for the next video. Peace.